Well, hello everybody. This is Joking John City 4, and today we'll be playing some TCG Card Shop Simulator. Now, I've seen this one being played everywhere as of late over the past week, and uh, I found it interesting. I actually played it yesterday, and it was pretty good. So I was like, you know what? Let me start a series with this because I think it's pretty fun. So, uh, so yeah, we're gonna be playing TCG TCG Card Shop Simulator, and. Um, Let's see how it goes. Let's see if we can grow our shop and make it profitable. So let's start our new game. Ah, do you want to delete the save file and start a new shop? Wait, what? Can I just save it on slot 2 or something? But uh, anyways, here we are. Little city. We got a food shop. We got a random street over there. So, uh, how do we start this off first? We get to name our shop, so what should we name it, boys? What should we name it? I mean, I usually gotta go with Tokyo Drift or something. Uh, well, I came up with a name. I think it's very simplistic. Elite Cards Expo. I mean, it's not an expo, like a convention or anything, but at least it's something. It took me a while to choose a name, I'm not gonna lie. It took me like more than 10 minutes. I think we can change it later. Right? Hopefully. Well, yeah, I don't think we can change it anymore. <laughs> I've been trying every button right now. I don't think I can change it. Well, oh well. The game is not the name of the store. If not, what you sell in the store? Can I move this thing? I don't like it here. I like it more like centered. Centered or next to this store, whatever the hell that is. And my other save, I kind of have like right here. Making sure it's not taking too much spots, too much space. We have ourselves a first shelf where we can post our stuff, our cool stuff. There we go. Open the phone and stock up on card packs. All right, we can get to buy some cool stuff. Uh, we can only, we can buy two, two sets. Quantity of thirty-two. There we go. Set it to the card. I don't think we can buy anything else, can we? No, not yet. I think we need to start selling first. There we go. Let's get some of these packages in here. Oh shit, wrong button. A few times over time, you will see me press the wrong button because I'm playing on an Xbox controller. God damn it. I'm so used to like a P PlayStation controller, so I'm sorry if you'll see like the notebook a few times. But I'm just horrible with an Xbox controller. Let me put these here. No items in it. Alright. Let's make some profit, boys. We can choose our own prizes, and also a fun thing, another, another fun thing, we can actually open the card packs. And the reason why the time is not moving in the upper left corner is because we haven't opened the store yet, so... So yeah, now we have to set a price. The market price at 236 how about we sell it for $3? I think that will be the right thing to do, kind of like round it off, you know? We gotta make some profit. To be honest, in my other save, I actually have it more expensive and it's still sold. But I'll try it out. And little by little, we're going to move up, you know? I kind of want to see, like, how the people react to $3 worth of uh, just simple booster packs. So, let's open up the store. I'm going to be more strategic this time. Cause my, I swear, my first save, I kind of messed up from the beginning. And then I started sending a bunch of stuff and I kind of cut up. But a little bit too late. So this is what we can also do. Uh, wait, hold on. Let me see what he's, how many he's gonna buy. He bought a lot of them, didn't he? Yeah. All right, let's sell our first pack. Give me the money, son. Change of seven dollars. Now, I was never a cashier in real life, so I would see the panic <laughs> firsthand from people that are cashiers in real life. Fifteen dollars. There you go, I'm making some money. Still got a thousand dollars though. Complete five checkouts. The the fun thing is we can take one of these, we can open the pack, and start collecting the cards ourselves. Now some of these, of course, we don't recognize any of these. This is just a bunch of made up things, but the card value, you can pretty much see it on the bottom right. You can get something that's very expensive or very rare. And then you can resell it later on, which is pretty fun. Yeah, a bunch of scrap, except for that. Except for those that cost like a dollar or two. So, so far, 
this is what we got our most expensive one is the dollar fifteen how can I kind of like sort of okay wait oh. so our most expensive are these two so far we're gonna do our own collection too look at my card you think you like it my card you like my card you like mini star you seem like you don't care boy you're in my store <laughs> I'm gonna overcharge you bro give me your card give me your ugly ass card not even a sticker on it embarrassing <laughs> you know you guys ever gone to the conventions you can actually like buy a sticker that can cover your credit card they look pretty badass though to the four dollars there we go I think they're overselling don't you guys think nine dollars Hmm. Oh, it says to open three packs. Okay. But yeah, you can open your own packs and uh, pretty much collect them yourself. Six cents, 37 cents, two cents, 22. Holy moly! 1,467? Right off the bat, I didn't even get this in my other save, bro. The most expensive one I ever had. Was like around 197. This is a thousand four hundred on a basic pack, bro. Five dollars, three cents. Now the only way I can make money is if um, I resell the card, which I don't have the stand for yet. You'll see how I can place it down. Twenty-three cents, twenty-two cents, ninety-one cents. But yeah, that's crazy, dude. I freaking got. One of the top cards right off the bat, man. Oh, let me sell all this stuff. That's crazy. I'll look at my collection in a bit. Five dollars. Here you go. Yeah, I never set it up in cents, but I gotta check how much I can squeeze from the customers, you know? I gotta be stingy. I gotta make some money. Buy a play table and put it in the shop. Alright, nice. Ah, my analog stick is broken. There we go. Can we buy two of them though? Oh yeah, we have to buy licenses for it. Wait, what? Oh no, never mind. Not for this one. You have to buy licenses for cards though, which kind of makes you overspend. Where can we put these? Can we put like the butt crack like facing towards the window? <laughs> Put it right there. Y'all right, can y'all can play cards now. Let's put another table. The thing is, we can actually charge them for playing in the tables. I'm not kidding. So the way you can charge them, see, if you go to your phone and go to the manage event. This is where they're playing with, right? So you can kind of change the formats to more expensive ones, but they're gonna charge you like for per tourney. So we're gonna play standard. We're gonna increase to 750. This is how I have it on my other save. 750 and they actually do play like that there you go so they pl go play over there and they, and they charge them 750 an hour the longer they're here the more money i make four dollars i'm gonna need to buy another food. man yeah they're overselling bro i'm about to make them a little bit more expensive 19 dollars worth of change why the f oh receive 40 dollars I'm gonna have to mess her all with the cents. Yeah, I'm probably gonna sell it for three fifty. I think that would be the right price for them. Change of a nine dollars. I'm gonna need to buy more. Wait, oh. Ah, it's a little bit confusing on the controller. I'm telling you. There you go, hundred bucks. I'm gonna change this to 350. Let's see how they sell. Hopefully they're not. Hopefully they don't consider it too expensive. 350. There you go. Restocking. Restocking. So fast. No more space. All right. Let 10 customers play cards and game in the shop. All right. With two tables, we should be fine. Hmm. 
They're not expensive, you just broke. No, they are expensive shit. I just raised them by 50 cents, bro. Alright, let's let's do 325. Let me there they'll be happy like that. Let me lower the price because I think let me just open another one. I'm gonna be addicted to this once. Wait, let me show you my collection. So this is my most expensive card. 1467. First it was a star, bro. Hey, you guys want to see my card? Look, this is something that you never have in your life. Yeah, look, he's feeling the pain. Oh my god, a thousand dollars right there. Yeah, feel it. Touch the card. Actually, don't touch the card. That will actually <laughs> ruin the grade of the card. Look at that. A solid 10 right here, bro. A solid 10 graded and everything. Well, actually, it's not even covered. Let me open another pack. Give me a pack. For the thing is, you can actually keep on opening packs, so you can like resell them later on. Dollar seventy-seven, one ninety, twenty-two cents, dollar eleven. Okay. Basic, pretty basic. All right, now I'm underselling. I might have to like lower it even more. Or maybe I should just leave it at three dollars, man. I'm not gonna struggle right now. Actually, I'm gonna need the money pretty soon, like much more faster than this. Let me see. I'll just leave it at three dollars. It was doing fine at three dollars. Mm, can I buy something else or no? I have to be level five. Accessories. Oh yeah, we can buy card sleeves. And also the cleaner. We gotta stock up on these. 40. Also, you can buy tabletop. Those are very expensive and they can actually make you a lot of money. Um, let's buy a small cabinet. We're gonna need that for the for the sleeves. Alright. Let me just check out this guy. Not in a inappropriate way get out of here <laughs> all right uh stock order let's order the card sleeves that's gonna be a very important somewhat Should I order one? Be fine. i'm not sure that's gonna feel like at least half of the shelf i think because it's 40 of them so i think they can feel like 32 per slot and to pr put a price on them Market price. Let's put it at 250. Hopefully that's not too low. Hey, whoa, whoa, hold on, hold on. Let me put the price. Don't start buying up like crazy, bro. Don't, 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 don't tread on me right here. Not now. Whoa. Yo, did you put? Did you buy that stuff before I put the price on, or did you? I'm afraid to check. <laughs> Oh no, it is at 250 okay. Man! I mean, it is the beginning of this stuff, so I'm guessing they just bought my packs and they're like, Dude, you should have ordered this stuff in the beginning. Actually, I, I couldn't though. My store was not level 2. Now it is. Alright, 5250 Damn, bro! Obsessed with card sleeves much? We still have enough time. Store closes at 9, by the way. I will play somewhere else. Alright, go then! No, no, give me that. You know what? I'm gonna open a car pack right in front of your face so you can see why you should buy here, sir. <laughs> Just giving myself excuses to opening packs. You see? This is why you should buy stuff here, kinda. 22 cents. He's not phased. <laughs> let, me, let me show you. Let me give you a reason. Reason number two. To check this out, bro. Check this out. Open up. Five cents right there. Boom. Twelve cents. Dollar thirty-six. Fifteen cents. Thirty-seven. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, mini star. Oh, holographic. You see, you can make making ten dollars per pack if you open them in my store. Let's get him. Let's get him this cool stuff. He must have been pissed at this point. <laughs> There you go. Me. 
Man, you guys are obsessed with this stuff. They'll be like, of course, you're a card shop, bro. Bullshit. It's getting a little bit dark. There we go. Okay. We need to restock up on card sleeves. We, uh, we're a little bit low. Um, we have $444. <laughs> Top, some on the bottom. There you go. Give me that money, son. Y'all doing okay over there? My dude looks lonely. Yeah, go play with him. Fee is too high here. Bro, it's $7.50. What's the matter with you? You know what? I'm going to lower it down so I can get a little bit more people in here. Um, cause, oh, that's wrong one. Let me see, let me see where's the match event. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna lower it to seven dollars and twenty-five cents. Cause you guys love, love to waste quarters. Oh shit, not seven thousand. Nobody's gonna play here. <laughs> seven thousand dollars an hour. Like freaking a celebrity be, better be playing here every day. Twenty-five dollars. There we go, we just finished the day. What do we need to stock up on? I think we have enough for the next day. Our shop is level 3. Can we already order the next ones? Not yet. We can already order the bigger boxes, but... Nah, we can't order nothing else. We can order the cleaner spray. This is actually very important. Quantity of 8. Just buy one. Yeah, we should be good. They can actually buy that spray, it's expensive too. Alright. What's the market cost on this thing? $10.47? Can I make it... Uh, 10 dollars maybe? Will it not complain like that? Good profit. I want to increase the price of that thing, man. I'm sending too many. Kind of got, got kind of have to like figure out like what's the good range so they won't they won't buy too much and leave you broke. Nine dollars. This is the beginning of something new, brother. I'm gonna need that half of the show for the new cards coming up. I think we're good. Uh, we got enough sprays. I'm gonna have to order more sleeves the next day when you have seven and thirty-two. Man, they cleaned me out on the bottom one. Okay, let me let me open a card. <laughs> That's, that will settle my anxiety. Hey, thirteen dollars for a bad rank. You see, when everybody leaves, I get out the good stuff, man. Thirteen dollars, nice. Alright, let's advance the day. Or should I pre-order some so I can get ready? Hmm. I can I can yeah, I'm gonna pre-order some. The good thing is you can still keep your, your uh, box on the side. I'm gonna order some of these and some of these. Get them ready. Have two hundred dollars left. And now we're gonna be making a little very little profit, but it'll be something. Here, put them in the back because now they'll steal the cards. No, I'm not sure if they steal it, but like, still. I get a little bit antsy. There you go. Good. We're stocked up pretty well. Hundred and eight items sold, revenue of four hundred and nine, profit of minus seven hundred and ninety-eight. I mean, we had to do a bunch of upgrades, man, right off the day one. 